the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of one piece so last episode was zoro's backstory all right we found out why he wants to become the greatest swordsman why he, he uses three swords all that shit and it was about a girl it's always about a girl at the end of the day <laughs> uh queena queena queen queen queena okay and she was a beast swordsman she was the best swordsman at the dojo even as a kid teenager she was better than all the adults better than her dad she was on her way to becoming a a really good female swordsman and according to her dad that doesn't happen very often so she was gonna break the mold right and of course zoro never beat her in 2001 bouts zoro never beat her and then her last bout they used real swords and she could almost kill his ass ending zoro's backstory right then and there but she didn't obviously um but yeah i thought that was kind of fucked up the dad was like because you're a girl you'll never be the greatest i mean that's just straight up sexist <laughs> i was surprised um but i mean it is what it is uh but anyway she was on her way and then obviously what actually well, not obviously i thought you know once uh, Zoro and Queena made that pact that they were both gonna strive to become the greatest. You know, I, I I thought ahead to a thousand episodes when they were gonna fight to be the greatest. You know, one v one. They're both twenty years later, all, all, all adults and type shit, new techniques. But then, five seconds after they agreed, she's dead. Apparently, she says she dead. She died because she fell down some stairs. Did I read? Did I read that wrong? First of all. My theory is she was straight up murdered. Someone as smart and strong as her would not die off falling on some stairs. Straight up. Okay, but I get it. You know, they they want to add to the drama, to, to, to the story, to the plot. I get it. Um, so maybe we'll return to that later. Maybe she was murdered. And, you know, even juicier, what if she was murdered by her dad? Her sexist dad. Because he knew, like, oh shit, she might, you know, she might dishonor us by beating all the men or some shit i don't know and then you know he murdered her i don't know that's very a very loose theory but that would make the the backstory even more juicy right so anyway she dies zoro cries and we found out that the i think the 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 sword that zoro keeps in his mouth is queena's sword so i thought that was really cool that was really feel again another feels episode um and it made it it made sense so far luffy Usopp and Zoro, we know their motive and it and it makes sense. You know, they want to do the greatest stuff because they kind of have to in honor of the people that they fuck with. Luffy to Shanks, you know, Zoro to Quina and Usopp to Kaya and the village. You know, it makes sense. We don't know shit about Nami, though. So we're probably going to get into her story eventually, hopefully. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Um but yeah that was pretty much last episode zora's backstory very very good um and i am excited to watch this next one so without further ado let's go and jump into this episode baby this is one piece episode 20 i believe uh before we watch the episode of course um if you're watching this on the tube and you're not a member of the channel members get access to uh, all the early reactions of one piece I'm, I'm like 20 20 plus episodes ahead or some shit so if you want to get access to those early episodes go ahead and click that join button down below to become a member okay uh, and of course, if you want the full versions of those reactions to go along with those episodes, uh, you can hit up the Patreon, which is linked down below in the description, right along with my Discord server down below as well. The Wolfpack server, come join. You want to tell me an anime or TV show that I can watch? Let me know in there. And last but not least, uh, like, like the video, you know what I'm saying? Comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell for notifications because all that helps support these videos, right? Anyway, with all that being said, here we are, One Piece episode 20. Let's get it. Ooh, famous cook. New character? I'm down. Is it that blonde guy that we keep seeing in the fucking intro? <laughs> Oh. 
Uh, <laughs> uh, I think that was us. <laughs> My bad, dog. <laughs> Limes? What the hell is that gonna do? Vitamin C? What? Scurvy? I've heard of that for pirate stuff, but what is that really? <laughs> nice. Okay. Nami thief slash doctor. Hey, yo, doctor would be a really good um addition to the crew. So Nami can play that role. Nice. We're definitely gonna need that. これは教訓ね。ああ、長い船旅にはこんな落とし穴もあるってことか。船の上では限られた食材で長旅の栄養配分を考えなきゃならないってわけさ。Nice. Well, at least we're learning now. You know, we have to be, we have to get our nutrients, get our vitamins, or else we're we're gonna get scurvy and possibly die. The what? Shinro <laughs> okay. To go find a cook and a hawkman. <laughs> what? <laughs> On the going merry with the straw hat, skull, skull and bones. Oh. The sea restaurant Barati? Okay, or barate, whatever. I don't know. Karate. <laughs> All right. Sounds good. That makes a lot of sense for a sea restaurant. In, in the One Piece movie, they have a tra they had a traveling Odin salesman that made food. So a sea restaurant makes a lot of sense, actually. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> Iron Fist full body of the of the Navy of the Marines. Oh shit! This might be the first Marines we're gonna fight. You know they're giving him a goddamn nickname. Well, actually, well, Alveda was a Alveda was a was a pirate. She wasn't a Marine. So yeah, this could be the first Marine fight that we might have. Shit. Oh shit! Sink them? What an asshole! No, we definitely gotta beat his ass. <laughs> you try to sink us? What was that? She got a little emoji there. We don't really see her do, you know, get feely at all. Was that pirate on that poster important or some shit? <laughs> Is he about to. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Uh oh, uh oh. <gasps> no! Luffy, you fucking idiot. He hit the restaurant. Oh, how are we gonna get, get it cooked now? They're gonna blame us. We gotta pay for the damages. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. That's... A hell of a mustache, sir. <laughs> and he's bleeding. Okay. Another manly man. <laughs> That's a pretty common pirate thing, right? To have a fucking wooden leg stump or whatever you call it. <laughs> Oh, 
That's a long time. Oh, God. Uh, okay, we need to compromise. A year's a little long. All right. Do we have Do we have some treasure that we can give him? Uh, we, we know Nami got some somewhere. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't... Oh, this is Sanji guy from the title and from the intro. Is that dude? Quite possibly, most likely, the fifth member? According to the intro. <laughs> he, and I feel like he just made a fool out of the full body guy who looks like one of them pride marines. So, uh, this can't end well. Oh, he pre-planned it? What a bitch. So he just gave him a different wine? <laughs> that's kind of... That's kind of petty. I like it. That's a... That's a hat. <laughs> that's a hat. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. What the hell was that? That's kind of breakdance technique, kicking attack? What the fuck? That's kind of cool. Oh, shit. I feel like the old man respects that Luffy just speaks so honestly. <laughs> okay, is that supposed to represent, you know, the boot stepping on the ant as if he's the boot but about to step on Sanji? Yeah, well, that's what it looks like. Okay, here we go. Oh. Oh, he's eating on his girl. Oh, shit. Oh. It was a metaphor, but also a play. <laughs> oh shit. This This guy is he's small manning him. <laughs> he's strong arming him. Oh. I mean you could door dash. Oh shit. Wait, what was the what was that attack? That was kind of similar to what the old guy did. Is that a sensei? <laughs> that would make sense. He's working here. Oh wait. Oh, he beat his ass. Senseless. Oh shit. Okay. Well, I know we just met him, but I kind of like him already. He seems like a bold, strong dude. And I think that's our cook, ladies and gentlemen. Holy Sanji, huh? All right. Well, I mean, first glance, yeah. Invite him. <laughs> I mean, we've seen him in the intro. Okay, so I'm 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 quite I'm quite positive he joins, right? <clears throat> uh, but yeah, we need a chef. We just talked about it. We met, and and I like how they set it up too. We we had these randoms who knew Zoro apparently in the past. One of them has scurvy, which means that he didn't he didn't have the right nutrients. He didn't eat the correct food. So what do they say? Hey, we need a cook. By the way, oh by the way, we're nearby Barati, a famous restaurant that you know lives on the sea. So yeah, it seems like a perfect place. To, 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 to grab a cook. All right. Uh, one thing I also noticed is the old man. Uh, I mean, he, he's fighting with Luffy. I don't know if Luffy's fighting back, but the old man seems like he knows how to fight. Also, he took a cannonball hit. Right? Nearby him. Any normal person would be dead. So he, But he just shrubbed it off. He was bleeding too. Uh, and he also has a fucking stump for a leg. So we gotta, we gotta, we gotta realize that 
hey, maybe this old man's been through some wars that we don't know of. You know what I'm saying? Um, and he did a pretty cool break dancing move that looks pretty similar to the move Sanji pulled off against the, uh, the 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 Navy guy. They didn't show it full on, but we saw them both spin around on some on their hands or some shit. I don't know what the hell that was. Um, but yeah, so I think that old man's probably a sensei. And Sanji said he's the sous chef. Sous chefs are the uh, sidekick chefs while well, he's the main chef. So it would make a lot of sense if that old man is a sensei. So that'd be kind of a cool little thing. Um, but yeah, I know I like Sanji, dude. He, um, he seems sophisticated. He seems bold. Uh, he seems confident, you know, in his cooking. He clearly knows what he's talking about. He said it took three days to skimmer the, skimmer the fish or some shit. I don't know. Um, but yeah, he, he, he knows uh, what he's doing right uh, and uh, and he clearly has no regard for the for the marines he made that guy he 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 didn't have any respect for the marine guy because he just knew he was an ass bag uh, so he made him look like one i like that i mean we're we're pirates so we're, we're against the marines right so yeah make him look like a dickhead that that, that he is <laughs> um but not only that it looked like he beat his ass pretty easily right uh if you got a name like full body marine guy um, he, I thought he was going to be a lot stronger, but it looks like Sanji just one-shot his ass. So, yeah, he's a cook. I think he can fight. And he's, he's got a, a very interesting character aura. So, yeah, I think this guy just joins, right? He just joins. I can see why he was in the intro. There's no way he doesn't join. <laughs> so, cool. All right. But the thing is, how does he join, right? Uh, I'm interested to see how, how, how we make that happen. But also... I mean, this isn't the first time that we ran into the Marines. The first time was was, was, was the first episode with Kobe, right? And, uh, you know, I, I think the Marines kind of let us off the hook there just because, you know, the, they saw that we were just trying to help out a friend. But this time, I mean, if Sanji does join the crew, Sanji would be the one that kicked the Marines' ass. And that's going to go back to headquarters. And then all of a sudden, you know they're gonna start saying hey the people with the with, 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 with the straw hat skull and bones they're causing some some problem out out there um and that's it that, that's gonna that, that might pull some marine aggro that we might not want or you that we, we might want i don't know luffy and zoro seem like they love to fight so maybe they they, they would invite the chaos but um yeah uh, i mean sanji hitting that marine i feel like meant a lot more than than what i gave off so uh anyway cool no, we met a new character, uh, probably joining us, you know, again, we saw him in the intro, so there's, there's no doubt in my mind that he's going to be the new cook, right? And a new, and a new fighter too, all right? I, 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 I was content with just adding on a cook, right? Um, but it looks like he's, a, he's also kind of a fighter, which is great, you know, the more fighters, the better, you know what I'm saying? And we also got a glimpse of Nami possibly being the doctor. So we have like all the main roles. We have our fighters, we have our captain, we have our cook, we have our thief slash doctor. Uh, it's, it's working out great. We have our sniper in Uso. It's working out pretty good. The crew's, the crew's forming. I see it. It's great. <laughs> anyway, good episode. Solid shit. And if you guys enjoyed the reaction, y'all know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Helps out the channel, you know what I'm saying? And of course, if you're watching this on YouTube and you're not a member, members get access to all the early episodes. I'm way ahead. I'm like 20 plus episodes ahead, but maybe even more. And if you want to have access to those early reactions, click that join button down below to become a member of the channel, okay? And of course, if you want the full versions of those reactions to go along with it, hit up the Patreon, which is linked down below in the description, all right? But it's also linked down below. Down there is my Discord server. Come join. Tell me an anime I can watch. Tell me a TV show like that I can watch. Or you just want to talk some stuff uh, and nerd out on some anime weeb TV show shit or about, or about games. Wolfpack server down below in the Discord. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys. I truly appreciate it. And I'll see y'all on the next episode of One Piece. All right? Peace.